。四月八日，由上海市新闻办等联合采制的百年大党老外讲故事百集融媒体产品在上海正式首发。这也是上海为庆祝党的百年华诞开展的主题活动之一，旨在向世界讲好中国共产党的故事。据悉，百年大党老外讲故事采访了一百位来自全球六大洲、三十余个国家的人士，他们当中有科学家、企业家、专家学者、艺术家、体育明星和普通的创业者，以外国人对上海所见所闻的视角讲述他们的感受和体会。当晚的首发仪式启动后，播放了由奥斯卡获奖导演科文斯讲述的故事。近年来定居在上海的科文斯来自英国，一直在用镜头记录他看到的真实的中国故事。作为百年大党老外讲故事首集短视频叙述者、制作人，科文斯说自己并没有从宏观的角度去讲述相关内容，而这似乎更像是他的一本个人回忆录，用镜头去呈现上海的变化和发展。My um. My personal reaction to being in China, in Shanghai, on the Bund, once when I was a very young man, and once now, 40 years later, and I think、um, what I would say is that everything that I see when you stand on the Bund, when you look in one direction. You see old colonial Shanghai, the the、um, the power of the Western nations is typified in the in the in the architecture, in the banks, in the you 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 feel the power of Western colonialism. You turn around 180 degrees, you look over here, you see the power of China, and I think what's interesting to me is just to I I just wanted to make that observation that. In 40 years, everything has changed. It's entirely to do with the energy of the Chinese people and the vision and the decisiveness of the Communist Party of China. 在柯文斯看来，中国的崛起或者中国的复兴是二十一世纪最大且持续的新闻故事。他说，这对于一个纪录片导演来说是一个绝佳的地方。同时，作为一个西方人，他认为自己更能了解同胞们所关心和感兴趣的内容。因此，他特别希望能通过自己的这则短视频，让世界更了解真实的中国。Everything I see every day in China is very new to me. It's very different than what I'm used to, and、um, so I'm looking at China through Western eyes because I'm Western, and、um, and I know what Western people. Look for, and I think telling it from a Western, through a Western eyes, is probably a stronger way to explain to the world what really happened, the truth about what happened. 据了解，百年大党老外讲故事百集融媒体产品于四月八日起正式上线，每天一集短视频加一篇故事文章，共持续一百天。